Hey, good morning, guys. Um, yesterday, I had you do a lab where you were looking at a uh, penny in a cup. You backed up, couldn't see it, but when you poured water into the cup, all of a sudden you could see it. So what we're looking at is, and I want to explain that to you today so that you have a chance of answering that last question. So what happens is, is you're looking down in and there is no water here. You can see the penny in the bottom of the cup. But if you back your eye up just enough so that you can't see it, and your eye is going here, your eye is looking right here, and you can no longer see the penny. The question is, why can you see it when you put water in? And, and the word is refraction. So what happens is when I put water in, when light goes from a thin substance, that thin substance is air, and it goes into a thicker substance, which is H2O, water, all right, when it goes into those, the light slows down. And if you remember anything in marching band, if you have a line of people locked and one side slows down, the whole line begins to turn. And so as the light goes through here, it's actually going to slow down and turn. And here's what it looks like. Well, the first thing you have to do is you draw the normal. The normal is that line perpendicular to the surface of the water. So if the surface of the water is right here, the perpendicular runs straight up and down here. So you're looking at it, you see the side of the cup, you don't see the penny, but as the water comes in, it's going to take this ray and it's going to bend it towards the normal. As it bends it towards the normal, all of a sudden it takes what you can see and it twists it down so that you've got a view of the penny. It works very similar, and I'm grabbing my jug of water here quick. It works very similar to what happens when you put a pencil in a jug of water. For instance, when you're looking at it this way, when I stick my pencil in, the pencil now looks broken. And if we're seeing it as a broken, it's because the light is bending as it goes through the water. And it's causing it to look funny. That's what is going on with that lab. Uh, so anytime you have light passing through an object, for instance, even if this was glass, if light goes and hits the glass, it's going to hit the glass. There's our normal. It's going to bend towards the normal until it leaves the glass. And then it's going to bend away from the normal, and it's going to go back out on its original path. That's what happens, and that's what's called refraction. I hope that helps you explain what went on here. Uh, we have a project coming up. Uh, your next assignment will be coming out in a couple days. What we're going to be doing is creating a video on waves. Uh, I'll have the instructions and directions out to you in just a little bit. Have a good day.